Oh my goodness, hot mess city right now. Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I am going to do a challenge and a challenge it will be because I'm going to do a full face using only my fingers. So I'm not gonna time myself this time just because I feel like using my fingers is challenge enough. Here we go. I have not moisturized yet, so I'm going to use my Moisturize 911 that on the face oh my gosh red city Ow. okay here we go I'm going to start with some primer and I am using my elf poreless face primer today and a little squeegee on the finger and this is normal because I usually apply my primer with my fingers anyway all right now for foundation. Now foundation, I always use my beauty blender. So this is gonna be kind of weird. So I have some It Cosmetics, Your Skin But Better CC Plus Illumination. Currently has more meaningful coverage cream plus, anti-aging, hydrating serum plus, SPF 50 plus UVA slash UVB, broad spectrum, physical chemical filter, free, carbon free, Oh my goodness. I don't think that I'm gonna have to worry about the SPF part right now because it's real cloudy outside. So I'm just gonna take a pump of that onto my finger. Get to foundationing. Ooh, feels like paint. Let's just do a little pat action all around the face. There, I'm ready to go. Let's go out. Where are we going? I'm going for the slap and slide method. Get it in those nostrils. Well, it definitely took down a lot of redness, so I mean, that's a bonus. And for concealer today, I am going to use my Born This Way Naturally Radiant Concealer in the color Fair. This is from Too Faced. I guess just slap a good dollop on that finger, right? So there it is on the finger, and then a couple. Now, I know that a lot of people use their finger anyway for their concealer, so I feel like that's not too big of a thing, except getting it right where you want it. I'm going to have to work on my blending skills, my finger blending skills. Um, I don't know how much that's actually doing in that. Just go with it. Just go with it. I got too much on the nose. I feel really slippery and sticky right now. Like a hog getting his breakfast on in a mud pit with slugs. That's what I feel like right now. While we're here, I'm just gonna slap on some eye primer. This is Smashbox 24 Hour Photo Finish Eye Primer. And this ain't no big thing, cause this is how I do my eyes all the time. So what'll really be interesting is when we get to the eyeshadow. What is next? We're gonna go for our bronzer. This is MAC Star Trek Edition, highly illogical. I love it. So this is bronzer, so I'm just gonna take my finger and go around. Yeah, look at that. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna have them sharp lines. I'm gonna carve out them cheekbones. Come on, cheek. Oh dear. Audio is messing with my video. You don't need to give yourself a bath. I can, I can do that later. And now we are on to blush. I'm using my Milani Big Blush in the color of Luminoso. So, get a little bit of that blush action happening. Top of the cheeks. Oh dear. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, I don't recommend doing makeup with your fingers. If you have always done your makeup with your fingers, let me know because I'm not sure how people do it. This is just crazy. All right, highlighter time. I am going to use my Jouer Rose Gold highlighter. Yes, look at that color, yes. Nice, a beautiful shimmeriness. Okay, and then, okay, 
not too bad. That's not too bad at all. It's very, very light. Alrighty. Oh, my face itches so bad. I guess we'll go straight into the lips, you guys. Straight into the lips. And I think for the lips today, I am going to use my Jouer Bronze Rose Lip Cream because I feel like that will be the easiest to apply with fingers. There's not much left in here. I wish I could just dive my pinky into this container. got some fallout from the lip cream. A little bit more on there for top lip. Oh my gosh, you guys. This, this is like the unibrow of lips. I, I look, I feel like I look like I just got into a box of cherry popsicles. That's what I feel like right now. Let's see if some lip topper can save us. This is Skinny Dip, also by Jouer. I'm just gonna put some of that onto the old finger. <laughs> it's like frosting, it's so delicious. There's no saving it, there's no saving it. Um, I'm pretty sure it's time for the eyes. So I will be diving into, what am I gonna dive into? I am going to, uh oh come back. I will be diving into my Nikki Tutorials, The Power of Makeup from Too Faced. This is her collaboration with them. And it's, I, this, you guys, this was my first makeup palette. It does smell faintly of chocolate, but it is um, a little old now. It's like over a year old, like a year, maybe almost two years old. Oh, my goodness. So we're going to go into Painkiller to set our base. So there is Painkiller. All right, there. We're just going to get that all over our lid and your eye holes. Next up, we're going to do the outer corner with a makeup and chill. And this is a beautiful deep brown color. So excited. All righty. So we're just going to pat that into the outer corner. I mean, deep circles around your eyes are totally in. I mean, that's gonna be the hot trend for 2018. And that popsicle look is just so hot. Now we're gonna go into, why not? Let's get a little glam crazy. We're gonna use a Mystic Hour and go in. Shine it. We're gonna put that right up in this area, right here. Yes, feels pigment. Oh, I should've used my other finger. I can't see when I do this, but I punch myself in the nose when I do this. All right, and just to add a little bit of smoke to the lower lash line, we are going to go in with Wanted. Up. Oh my goodness, you guys. Smoke out that lower lash and then creep it up into the corner. I think I got a little carried away on this corner. All right, and then I'm gonna take some Frosted Yum and we are going to put that on the inner corner. And we are looking pretty darn good, if I can just say so myself. Take a little bit more of that pink color and just kind of blend it, blend it in. Kind of soften up your black edge. And then I'm gonna go in with Ivy just to accentuate under the brow. And eyes are done. Now, what do you think, guys? Oh dear. And all we need now is to finish it off with some mascara. Now, I've seen a lot of people do a lot of these challenges and they don't use their finger to apply their mascara, but I'm gonna use my finger to apply mascara. So, let's just get that nice and on there. Okay, so here we go. And Switch 
those fingers. I think we have an A plus look you guys. Okay, and then to set this in place so it lasts all day long, we're going to use our e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set Spray. Now, obviously I can't use my fingers to set my face, or maybe I can, let's find out. <sighs> so refreshing. Totally socked myself in the eye. And got some stuff in my mouth. All right, now we just need to do our hair and we will finish off this beautiful look. And that is it, guys. That is a full glam face using fingers only. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button so you can be notified when I upload new videos. And leave me a comment. Let me know what your favorite glam look product was that I applied to my face with my fingers today. Thanks so much, guys. Bye!